high grade sevens. So in this video, we're going to be talking about number 167 in your method book. And this one is called the key of concert F major. It might have a slightly different name if you play a different instrument that's not in concert pitch, but that's okay. Number 167. For the past few videos, we've been focusing on uh, pieces and songs that are in the key of concert E flat major. Now we're going to change it up. So now we're going to have a different key signature. This one is the key of concert F. So if you play the flute or the euphonium or the trombone, this is going to be one flat in your key signature. One flat. Okay? So that means that all the flats that you had before, you're going to get rid of them, and you're only going to have B flats. So you're going to play A naturals, and you're going to play E naturals as well. E naturals. Okay? So if you play the trumpet or the clarinet or the tenor saxophone, uh, that means that your key signature is going to have one sharp in this one. So we're going to get rid of the flats, and we're going to replace it with one sharp. Okay? So that means that you're going to be playing... Uh, B naturals in this, and you're also going to be playing F sharps, so be careful of that. And if you play the, what am I looking at here, alto saxophone or the berry saxophone, you now have two sharps in your key signature. Before you didn't have any sharps, now you're going to be playing C sharps, and you're going to be playing F sharps, okay? So just be aware of that. Here it is, number 167. Concert F major. I'm going to play it first, then we're going to play it together. Remember, if there are some notes in here that you're kind of uncomfortable with, pause the video, take a look at them, and then come back to it. Again, some of them are kind of high, so don't worry about it if it's a little bit out of your range for now. We're going to work at it, we're going to get it back into your range. Okay? I'll play it first, you listen. One, two, ready. <sighs> See, even I had some trouble getting up to those high notes today. But, uh, oh, what was I going to say? I don't know. Uh, yeah, so those higher notes mean that you're going to have to use faster air, and you're going to have to really make sure that you are focusing this uh, embouchure, your mouth, to make sure that air isn't escaping out of the sides, uh, and you're going to want to try and relax as much as you can, even though it's going to be a little bit high. Okay? We're going to play it together. Remember, take a look at your key signature. Make sure that you're playing all these right notes. You might notice that if we're playing it right, it'll sound exactly like number 163 that we played in one of the last videos, but it's just going to sound a little bit higher. So it's exactly the same, but a little bit higher. Let's play it together. 167, key of concert F major. One, two, ready. <sighs> There it is. Once again, we're not going to play it too fast right now. You can play it faster if you want, uh, but focus on just trying to get some of those notes a little bit more comfy and making sure that you're playing all the right notes. Double check your key signature. Make sure that you're playing the same notes as I am. Really, really listen. Nice work. That was number 167, the key of concert F major.